Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. And in today's video, I have another nail trainer tip for you guys. I did post a video on how to apply regular nail tips to a trainer hand. So you guys wouldn't have to be using these horrible replacement tips. I'll go ahead and link that video below. But after I posted that video, a lot of you were asking if there's any way um, to avoid using these when you're applying nail form. So I'm going to go ahead and show you that. So what I'm going to do, it's I'm going to basically do the same steps that I did on my other video. I'm going to use one set of these, you know, nails, but I, I don't need this part. I just need, you know, this little part. So I'm going to go ahead and cut it off. With, so I'm gonna go ahead and put it back and I don't know if you can see but it's if you put a nail on here this is a little bit raised so I'm gonna go ahead and get my drill I'm gonna I'm gonna file that down just a little bit okay and then this is what I'm gonna be using next I'm gonna use these um, these are like the, the dual forms. This is how you use it. You know, the little tabs go in front or on the free edge. But we're not going to use them like this. We're going to flip them over because we need those little tabs on the back or on the cuticle area. So what I'm going to do first, I'm going to file, you know, where I'm going to glue it on to that little part. I want to file it just to make that you know area a little bit rough. I think that's good. So this is where I want to glue it. Now it's it's better if where's my little thingy here? This. So I put this thing back on, and then I kind of eyeball it, see where I want it, because I want to. You know place it down I want to set it down and I'm gonna put the glue right here and then I'm gonna put this little thingy on now to glue it I'm not gonna use you know the regular nail glue because that's just not gonna work it's just you know gonna end up popping off so I'm gonna use some hot glue so I'm gonna apply I'm gonna apply quite a bit because I do want that little part to stay on there you know because with these things you know these forms are meant to pop pop things off so let's see it goes this way so I'm gonna set it right there I didn't do it right here while this little part was on the finger because sometimes it can get a little messy so so I'll go ahead and let that dry so once it dries completely you know that is it you know this is what you're going to be using so you put it back you can put it on you know put it on and take it off as you can see and then right here you can you know you can do a design actually on it if you guys don't want to ever use tips again you know just leave it like this you can just shape it you know if you want a coffin shape you can you know shape it uh, like a set into a coffin shape you can shape another one into like a ballerina you can shape it into whatever you want the only thing is of course you don't have a lot of length if you do like to work on longer nails but I'm going to show you how to apply a nail form using one of these so if you want to apply a nail form what I do I'm just going to use it as a nail bed so I'm going to cut the tip off and then I'm going to file it into shape I'm not going to file the surface. Now that it's all shaped and that you have, you know, a nail bed, you can now apply a nail form. So I'm going to go ahead and apply it. You know, try and get it nice and straight and that is it, you know. And as you can see here, 
it's pretty flush so you really don't need to do any filing just you know put your nail form and you can go ahead and start working and with this if of course if you have longer ones you can you know make uh, a longer nail if you wanted to it, it's all up to you but you know that is how you would apply a nail a nail form and they, these of course you can use over and over again so I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys how to sculpt the nail on this So now that the nails are all done, I just simply, you know, take it right off and then I'm just going to pull back on these little tabs. That's why I left them on and it should pop right off. Now you can clean, of course, the nail, file it and make it nice and, you know, and pretty. And this is what you're left with. So you can just pop it back on and then, you know, you can sculpt another nail. And then this is the one that we left the whole um, dual form, you know, complete. So I'm just going to take it off and I'm going to do the same thing. You got to, you know, kind of twist at the tip as well. And it starts to come off. And see, it comes right off. You know file that down just to make it you know nice and clean and then this one is ready to go again you just pop it back on and you can do you know another nail so there it is you guys that is how I apply nail forms to the nail trainer without having to use those horrible horrible replacement tips so um, now these might you know pop off every now and then but that's okay you can always glue them back on and then you know, you just do one set, like you can do one set of these or one set of these and that's it. You can use them over and over again so you guys never have to use those, you know, like I said, horrible replacement tips. So I hope you guys liked this video. If you did, you know, thumbs up and let me know. And let me know what other, you know, videos you guys want to see. And I'll see you guys on my next video. Bye.